my name is Carrie Blair, senior artist for MAC Cosmetics, and today I'm going to show you how to do a colorful take on a smoky eye using the MAC Nutcracker Suite collection. So we've already prepped Courtney's skin. Because the makeup uh, focuses on the eye, I'm going to go ahead and curl the lash to kick off this makeup. I'm just going to apply a very light veil of powder just to catch any fallout. So I'm going to be using a little bit of black track liner to start this makeup. We're going to start at the lash line and use the entire flat surface of the brush to pull this color up onto the lid. Gently blend the black track onto the lid. Keep the color the most intense by the eyelashes. We're going to use the Nutcracker Sweet Cool Eye Compact. I'm going to go in with this bronzy color to start. And we're going to just place this right in the center of the eyelid. You can almost apply it in a bit of a circular motion. I'm going into this beautiful plum magenta shade. We're going to start in the crease of the eye and work this color back and forth. We can use a little bit on the inner part of the eyelid and a little bit in the outer part of the eyelid and then connect it through the crease, following the natural shape of the eye. Now we're going to add a little bit of Prunella eye pencil into the waterline of the eye. You really will intensify the smokiness of the eye. Now you can also use this to create a little bit of shadowing under the eye. Using this beautiful plum tone, we're going to blend out the color under the eye. This will encase the entire eye in this beautiful plum tone. Now we're gonna go in with this darker plum shade and do a little bit of intensifying on the outer corner of the eye. We're going to blend that with the 224 brush. I'm gonna repeat that underneath the lash line as well. This gives a lot of rich dimension to the eye. The inner corner highlight, I'm going to use English Gilt Pigment. And I'm just going to tap that right in the inner corner. This is an excellent way to open up the eye and bring light to the center of the face. I'm going to be using a little bit of blunt and a little bit of sincere blushes. And starting at the back of the cheekbone, I'm going to work this product onto the skin, under the cheek, in a round circular motion, moving forward towards the end of the mouth. Up into the hairline a bit, just to warm the face and to create a little bit more intensification of the bone structure. We're going to add a little bit of color using the Nutcracker Sweet Copper Face Palette and gently buff it into the cheek. I'm gonna take a little bit above the eyebrow. This gives a little lift to the face. It helps to pull all the color together. Now we're gonna highlight using Whisper of Guilt. And we're gonna use this right on the top of the cheekbone just to really bring out the full shape of the cheek. So I want the mascara to be a little clumpier for this look. In Extreme Dimension really helps you to build volume in the lash. It almost gives a spidery effect. I'm gonna use a little bit of brown eyeshadow. This one happens to be called Concrete. And I'm just gonna come into the brow, give it a little bit of shading. Then I can use the spoolie brush to brush the brow and the shadow together. So we're gonna use a color called Tuned In, which is sort of a nudie brown to create balance and a nice finish on the edge of the lip. So this look is the perfect complement to any holiday party. Using a bit of color is a great way to modernize and play up a smoky eye.